I'm Sather Duke. Uh, I live here on the farm with my wife, Ruby, and uh, my daughters, Kestrel and Freya. So I'm Ruby Duke, and this is our farm, Raven and Boar Farm. And uh, what we're trying to do, I guess it's a story that started a couple years ago, just four years ago, where we started a farm by accident. Just figuring out how we could eat better and take care of our family a little better. What we've grown to realize in just a couple years is that, you know, what our interests are, which is raising beautiful, healthy animals that look amazing and have amazing lives. We're trying to tell the story of our farm, how we started, how much we can do in such a short amount of time, and what I think we can become a really amazing product from our own animals. Uh, for me as a chef, I've always wanted to visit all the farmers that I've ever known. It's been about seeing the food, being around it. Oh, it just makes so much sense. Like the, the pig is such a versatile animal and what you can do with it is limitless. And charcuterie is one of the best ways to utilize all the parts that you can't otherwise use. Pig is the most dynamic animal. Every part, every way of curing it, it's just amazing. My name is Paul Wetzel. I'm in charge of the charcuterie program at Gramercy Tavern. The reason that this is so important is that there are very few facilities in this part of the country where people can produce the kind of whole muscle cures and things that, uh, that Ruby and Sather are trying to produce. But this would give us an option of a place where we could come, have a product produced. It's within a day's trip of our restaurant and it would, it would enable us to basically do something that, that we don't have the means or the facility to do where we're from. I think it would be incredibly important for us and, and potentially for a lot of other commercial businesses in, in New York and Brooklyn. Four years ago, this is what I knew. I can take something from my garden, I can plant a seed and I can make carrots and peas. And then four years later, what I came away with is I can take a pig and raise it right and break it down right and make amazing food, amazing charcuterie that I can share with other people and making product that's all grown and raised and then become charcuterie all in one place would just be really cool. We really got into the idea of making a finely crafted product, just in the same way that we do with our furniture. Ruby and Sather are um, somewhat of a pioneer in, in doing this because I think a lot of people want to do it. I just don't know anyone that is doing it currently or that is doing it well. Their commitment to creating such a quality product, they only want to do it if it's the best. That's the kind of people we like to work with. It's a great group of people with a great idea on a great piece of land with great pigs trying to make something even greater. I guess we met Ruby and Sather about 10 years ago when they were designing furniture in Brooklyn. Um, they've been my chicken support staff. And the sausage is really good. They just raised some of the best pigs we have ever seen. And the products that they produce, the pork is, is awesome as well. White oh. sausage is in my refrigerator. Rubies. I like to eat them. Is this an intestine part? My husband, who is amazing and works so hard. I think that their drive and motivation is worth 
any donation. But no matter what, they're gonna do. I get tired just hearing about all the stuff they're doing, actually. The list just keeps going. They do a lot. Like, we go home and we, like, want to have a nap, and they, like, just keep working. Oh.